Good morning. Thank you for starting your day with Denver 7 News. I'm Nicole Brady and I'm Brian Sanders. Here are your top stories for Wednesday. The Table Mesa King Supers in Boulder is reopening its doors this morning. It's been 11 months since a gunman opened fire inside the store, killing 10 people. This morning's ceremony will first honor the victims and the doors will open at 9 a.m. Denver 7 was able to get an inside look at the newly remodeled building. There's a new entryway, higher ceilings and more light. King Super says safety was at the forefront of the remodel. The state says it has given out more than 2 million at home tests and nearly 4 million masks since it began distributions last month. Meanwhile, COVID cases continue to fall. Tuesday, the state reported nearly 2,900 new cases, which is the lowest daily case count in several weeks. The state reported just over 21,000 cases last week. And for some context, at the height of the Omicron wave in January, there were about 90,000 cases in a single week. And a billionaire has thrown their hat into the ring to take over ownership of the Broncos. Byron Allen, the late night TV comedian, interview host and now media mogul, says he will officially be putting his name in the hat to bid to buy the team. If his purchase is successful, it would make him the first black majority owner of an NFL team. Here's meteorologist Lisa Hidalgo with your Denver 7 forecast. And it's another really mild start to our day. Not quite as warm as what we saw yesterday, but you're going to find some upper 20s to low 30s. Denver just a touch warmer right now in the mid to upper 30s. We do have a little increase in cloud cover this morning and we're tracking a weak system that's going to roll in today. As far as temperatures go, though, very similar to what we saw Monday and Tuesday. Highs are going to be right around 48 to near 52 degrees. We've got Denver at right around 50 upper 40s near Castle Rock and Aurora 30s upper 20s to low 30s in the mountains. Now in the high country today, we are seeing increasing clouds and there's a chance for a little light snow, a better chance for a little snow here in Denver late Friday night into early Saturday.